At last, uh, the enigma has been completed. It's old, but we reinforced it with some devices. It should work fine. Uh, well, we're ready. Cool. The time has come at last. We are going to launch the Enigma. The fate of the Earth depends on it. The energy, the power, the angle. Everything is clear. All right, blast off. Blast off. Blast off. Blast off. <laughs> okay, we get it. I already know it's not gonna work. I mean, unless we, oh God, that would be horrible if we actually got the RNG. So this does actually destroy the space colony <laughs> because the thing is, I need Zero to die. And this would prevent him from dying, I believe. Actually, no, because then it would go to the space shuttle, and if that fails, then Zero dies. But to be fair, there's still a chance with RNG <laughs> that that could work. <laughs> and that would be miserable if, like, the one time that I want to fail, it gives me, like, the 1% the succeed rate. As I think it's more like, 20%, but, uh, you know, as you know, 5%? Uh, you know what? I have no idea, nor do I really care. Anyway. Did we make it? Did it crash? Alia, give us the reports. Negative. We destroyed only 62%. We have merely made uh, it change in orbit and delayed the time of the impact. <sighs> Curses. The Enigma was not successful? No, but we have a backup plan. Let's concentrate on our next move. All right, we will execute the shuttle operation. Don't give up hope. The future of the Earth depends on us. This is our last hope. The Space Shuttle Operation. The shuttle will approach and fly into the colony. The pilots will eject at the last minute. It's very dangerous because they could get sucked into the blast. In the end, I fear that this will fail, just like the Enigma. We need to gather as many devices as we can to strengthen the shuttle's power. But the autopilot function doesn't work. Okay. Gather as many devices as you can. Yeah, we'll try to upgrade it from here. Uh, this is the last chance for us. Yeah, I know this mission is hard for you all, but the important thing is for us to stay optimistic. Oh, wait, I think that was Cygnus, but uh, whatever. Now, let's get to work. Our only hope is the space shuttle. We cannot waste any time. Let me describe the four Mavericks that have the devices to upgrade the shuttle. Spike Rose Red. Details unknown. He carries a concealed orbiter engine. Yeah, I think his name was Axel the Red. Burn Dino Rex. A weapon storage guard. He owns a booster for the rockets. Uh, what was his name? It was like Mat Matrix, I think? His name was a weird one. Spiral Pegasus of the Rebel Force's air wing. An orbiter wing is at his base. I think he was the Skeever. Or maybe it was just Skeever with no the... I don't know, it was something like that. <laughs> and then Dark Necrobat, a.k.a. Dark Dizzy. Actually, maybe I'll go for him first, just because I remember him being, like, the worst of the eight bosses. Not to mention his stage is just... Uh, I remember it being really, really annoying. Dark Necrobat, a mysterious maverick, he has a fuel tank. We have little time, 
but we have to gather as many devices as possible. I am really struggling to do the voice I gave Cygnus. Do we have more? Okay, no, no, no. We actually, you know what? You know what? I did say I was going to switch to this, so let's just get that over there. No, no, buttons, what are you doing? <laughs> Actually, then again, if I'm going to do this stage, I remember flight being, like, I remember this stage being an absolute nightmare. I just don't remember exactly why that was. So, uh, I guess let's just get this out of the way. <laughs> And I know I said I wasn't going to use this armor, but if for some reason I remember it being, like, required, almost. But, on the bright side, if we get the really annoying bosses out of the way, I'm hoping the rest of this will be nowhere near as infuriating. Although, this music is actually really cool. Um, at first glance, it may seem to be an ordinary planetarium, but in truth, it's also a space laboratory. Why don't you borrow a fuel tank for the space shuttle? But before you do that, there's something strange about the planetarium. <laughs> Immediate flashbacks to that South Park episode. So, the Sigma virus has already polluted this facility, too. Your visit to the planetarium will be very interesting, I, I guess. Yeah, um... I guess that's one way of putting it. Hey, you know what? Right, that slows us down. I'm picking up a Maverick reading at the Constellation. Watch out! Um, cool. Oh, hey, look. More Sigma virus. Yeah, you know what? Oh, right. Because if I remember right, I believe those spikes will instantly kill us. <laughs> so yeah, it's actually going to be in the my best interest to just, like, rush forward through everything. Actually, wait, is the game running slow, or is it the stage? Because I know sometimes this game, actually, a lot of these collection things, they just start running at, like, a third of the usual speed. But, like, the music is fine. So, I don't know. I might have to see. I guess you need to get on the lift. It's unstable, but there's no other way. Sure. Okay, yeah, hang on. It's running fine here. No, get the hell out of here. Okay, yeah, I think it's just like a gravity thing then. And of course that doesn't kill him. Because, you know, that would have been too easy. And really? <laughs> Why? Watch out for the track. It isn't moving on the right course. If you sense any danger, jump on the nearest place as soon as possible. You mean what we've been doing this whole time? <laughs> God, it's, oh, 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 oh no, why? Okay, well, again, that would have been so good to know the first time it happened. Not like, you know, the seventh. It's dumb things like that that really make me just look at this game and go, like, who thought that was a good idea? Like, there's a lot of stuff in games where the presentation is so important just to get a good impression on like new players, on returning players, on, on all this stuff. And that kind of stuff would probably make this game one of the worst games for new people, or I guess people who are new to the series, to like even consider giving a chance. 
This is the gravity reverse device. It can control gravity and turn it upside down. Of course, you may be able to take advantage of it. Cool. Okay. Although I will say, I do kind of like the spate. Why did enemies... Okay, well, you know, maybe enemies just decide to spawn when we flip gravity. Oh, oh, that's a thing. Okay. Oh. Okay, so that respawns the Sigma and, damn it. Okay, well, you know what? Iframes at the very least. Oh. Okay, hopefully, nope, it does respawn him. But you know what? I want the life. So you get the hell out. Oh. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I knew that was going to be really, really close, but I wasn't quite. Ooh. All right. Well, that's a thing. Uh, if we do this. I don't think it really changes anything. Okay, well, also, if those guys could die, that would be awesome. Ooh, okay, well, at least we have iframes. Really? <laughs> God. I mean, I think we can absorb, like, eight or so of the... Actually, wait, wasn't there... Yeah, there is absolutely something down here. The question is, do we have whatever it is that we need? Because... Game, I swear to God. Okay. Oh, right. This is absolute hell. How much do you want to bet this is probably going to be this boss's weakness? Yay, there we go. God, that sucks. This is the program for your head part of the Gaia armor. Analyze and upload the data to your main memory in a uh, something area. Once you upload all four programs, the Gaia armor will be complete. Cool. I am... Um so glad that he did not just go through rambling about how we need the four po oh we can't even go back and farm for energy all right well i guess i will never know if that was his weakness or not i mean i will during the inevitable boss rush but i guess we'll just have to wait and see oh look bats Squeak, I've been waiting for you. Hey, can't you... Hey, can't you understand the urgency of our present situation? There's no time to fight. Uh, squeak, who cares? I don't take orders from anyone. The word Sigma means nothing to me. Where the hell did that come from? Now destroy all mavericks, like you. Squeak, I'm always ready. Okay, that is, like, the most... Like, where the hell is that coming from kind of dialogue? Okay, now we just need to... Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Right, and he's, like, just out of reach the entire time. But yeah, I'm pretty certain this is another one of those bosses that will like, absorb our own life or something. Okay. Well, you know, if he keeps doing this, that'd be awesome. Okay. I remember this guy having some really... Oh, no. Some really, really annoying moves. 
right. Yeah, he can just freeze us. Oh, right, because this is the boss that gives us the... Uh, what's it called? It basically like the, the freezing ability that is basically required for uh, Shadow Devil's stage. Okay, anyway. Thanks to brute forcing and ignoring all of the mechanics that was, you know, intended to be done in this stage, this stage wasn't that bad. God, how sad is that? <laughs> a stage? <laughs> it's a stage that if you literally refuse to play it the way that the developers intended you to play it, it's actually bearable. Yeah, yeah. DNA stuff. Yeah. Just give me the thing. I'm always afraid I'm going to start mashing that button and then accidentally select one of these. Anyway, what was this guy's name? Okay, so life will give us the antivirus guard, which increases the defenses against the infection uh, of Sigma virus, uh, which means we'll need to get hit eight times before we get infected instead of four. Okay. I thought we actually had to get hit eight times without this, but that is good to know. Or we can take the energy, which will allow us to destroy the virus with basically our weapon. And you know what? That sounds significantly better. Just reduce the chance altogether. Or I guess allow us to actually fight back. So yeah, let's grab that. And we got the dark hold. Wonderful. Can't wait to never use that except for one very specific level. Parts complete. Hey, we finally got a life up and the quick charge. Awesome. Dark, ne dark Necrobat had an unusual past. He was a maverick created three years ago by Sigma. But you have destroyed him. Since Sigma scattered a large amount of the virus, he doesn't have any energy left to reproduce himself. What? I... <laughs> I did not register what any of that meant. And by the way, you found the fuel tank. Now the shuttle will be able to fly to the space colony. Please return to the Hunter Base quickly. Uh, sure. <laughs> and then I think I am actually going to just take a bit of a break of this because Izzy Firefly's stage. I don't know why that one got under my skin so quickly. It was literally a week since I last recorded this. <laughs> but for whatever reason, that stage really got under my skin. I literally went into this thinking like, okay, you know what? I'm just going to have this kind of whatever happens, happens attitude. I'm just going to try and enjoy things and just live in the moment. <laughs> and that stage immediately made me go, you know what? Fuck that. This game sucks. <laughs> yeah, you know, if you couldn't tell just by... I guess this guy's stage, I, I, I just was not having any of it. But I feel like if you play this game in very small controlled segments and then space it out over like the course of months, or I guess weeks in my case, this game is almost bearable. Every other Mega Man game, I've just sat down and played like a few hours of at a time or played like the first eight bosses and then like came back to it after editing everything and basically finished the rest of this game. But this game is quite literally just going to be a by the level, just beat my head against a brick wall kind of game. And again, I know there are people who love this game, which is great because somebody has to love this game. But I can honestly say the only reason why I'm even playing this is just because I love Mega Man in general. 
And I kind of feel a little obligated to actually do a playthrough of this game since I've done all of the other ones up to and even past this one. So, yeah.